everybody, this is Frank from Be Young RV in Milwaukee, Oregon, the greater Portland metro area here in Oregon. And I get to show you a brand new 2013 Tiffin Allegro Red in the 34 QFA model. Uh, this happens to be in the sunlit sand, so we have this nice coral here and a lighter copper style color up on top. But anyway, uh, the red is the uh, the start of the diesel pushers for uh, Tiffin. You'll notice up here in the front, got a nice easy hood to open up. And we'll have an 8,000 kW Onan diesel generator up front. They only use Onan and diesel generators. One piece windshield, nice big wiper blades, bus style mirrors. The sideboard cameras will be right in here, inside the mirrors. We're gonna have Alcoa style aluminum wheels on here. Uh, this happens to be on the Freightliner chassis. It'll have a Cummins engine with 340 horses in it and a six-speed Allison transmission. Michelin tires on here. You'll notice up above, we're gonna have a Dometic uh, awning over the door. And as you notice here, you'll see the front cap on this. Uh, this is a cap that was on the Phaetons last year, and, and that's moved down to the red. And we'll have a one-piece fiberglass roof up there. Now the thing is about the fiberglass roof on uh, all Tiffins, that's actually a molded fiberglass roof, kind of like a bathtub upside down. So about the thickness of a football helmet. We do have a TV outside that's new. That was on the Phaeton in the bus last year, and they moved it down to uh, the red. Got a uh, Dometic awning here. We'll have 60,000 BTUs of uh, propane furnace in here. Plus we also have a heat pump in one of the air conditioners on the roof. Propane is in here. Got your storage down here, pass-through storage. You could actually put a tray inside the basement in here if you, if you wished. Uh, we install those here at B Young RV here in Milwaukee. Uh, not a big deal, we do it quite often. And there's some extra chairs in there for the inside to go along with the slide out table. You see the thickness of those doors? I can slam these doors, no big deal. A Little more access, of course we have central back in here. Uh, you'll notice there's lights everywhere inside. There's one here and there's one up on the other side. Like I say, this is full body paint. This happens to be in the sunlit sand. There's two coats of clear coat on here. Tiffin RV does paint their own coaches. And uh, the paint on here is the same paint that's used on Mercedes Benz. Again, nice one piece cap. As we move up, that's the uh, vent. Does have a stackable washer dryer in here and is vented to the outside. Of course, access to the back of the engine here. This happens to be a rear radiator model. You got access to check your oils and your fluid levels in here. Do have a 5,000 pound hitch with a seven way barge in back here. And you'll notice the backup camera up there. Uh, that was a change in 2013. This cap was used on the Phaeton. We'll have the two uh, engine batteries back here and a battery disconnect is back here also. We have two disconnects here, one for the house and one for the uh, uh, engine batteries. 50 amps have it underneath the, uh, the front slide and it makes it really tough. Anyway, we got full filtration water. You can turn the water pump up from here, your soap dispenser. Uh, you can uh, fill your tank from here. Uh, whatever you want to do, this is a full service. I do like this aspect where I can turn this up so I don't get dribbles <laughs> and put the cap on kind of a safety thing. And then you put your sewer hose down through the bottom. You got your own little basket for the sewer hose so you can rinse it out, put it in there. Outside shower, tank flush, you name it. Paper towel rack, nice big door. Slam and don't worry about it. Tiffin's number one for a lot of reasons. One, the warranty, a 10 year structural warranty and a five year lamination warranty. If you take care of an, a Tiffin, it'll last you a lifetime. That's the idea when you step up to a Tiffin, is you, this is your final RV or your first RV that'll last you forever. Let's move on to the inside. 
Welcome to the front cab of this Tiffin Allegro Red 34 QFA. A lot of changes have been done. Uh, number one is we've got a GPS here. Of course, we have a colored uh, monitor up here for the uh, backup camera. A nice, uh, you know, non-reflective type. Uh, you got sideboard cameras, as I said before, in the mirrors. You can turn those on, and uh, we're going to have a solar shade. You got the night shade. Nice thing about having the solar shade, you're driving into the sun, but you can adjust that solar shade if you had to be driving into the sun so you don't get the migraines. My wife complains about it all the time when we're in our motor home. We got a Panasonic TV up front here. This happens to be a repeater. So if I'm sitting down there in a the lounge and I got the DVD going, I can actually just point right at the repeater and back it up, fast forward, or shut it off. But look at the cabinets. This is all solid uh, wood here. There's no paper wrap on a Tiffin. Competition at this price range, which would probably be higher with the competition, we're gonna have paper wrapped here. This is an access panel up here for pulling the slides that are in the front here. Uh, your wine guard antenna, your hot water heater, you have gas and electric, your service panel here to check your, your tank fill. Uh, this of course has an air mattress, high to bed, flex steel, ultra leather. Um, you know, ultra leather, you can crunch it uh, and it'll come back to life. Uh, you, it's dog friendly. You can wash it with uh, a light mild, for, uh, like 409. They even have a formula if you happen to have a ballpoint pen and uh, you got ballpoint, there's a formula to clean that up. Uh, again, we have uh, the MCD shades uh, throughout the coach. Nice lights, sound bars down in here for speakers. You don't see speakers hanging in a Tiffin. Look at the depth of the cabinets. Again, real hardwood. Uh, we have the Avalair uh, uh, countertop here. Uh, you know, Bob is, uh, or Tiffin RV has done a lot of testing over the years. This has been very successful, no cracking. This one happens to be in the, uh, it will have the English chestnut cabinets up here. I love the English chestnut. And then we have the city lights interior. Nice, mild, uh, conservative uh, decorations in here. Nice, deep stainless steel sinks in here. Just like at home. Window in the kitchen, three burner cooktop, convection microwave, big one. Instead of having an oven in here, which I see out of 100 customers, only two of them use them, we get some drawers. Everybody wants extra drawers in here. Nice roller bearing guide. You got the big storage underneath here. You actually have a place down here to put your um, stove top and um, sink top covers. Like again, we have a full filtration water system in here. You even get a waste paper basket with a tiffin. How good is that? And more drawers over here. We'll swing over to this side over here, another Panasonic uh, TV. We do have two. Now when the slide's in, we can't watch this, but with the drivers, uh, those nice chairs up front, those Phaeton chairs, we can turn that around and be able to watch TV up here. Or if somebody wants one, one program, somebody else can watch a program back here. Sound bars down here. This does happen to have, instead of the, the C-shaped uh, lounge that's available, this does have the table uh, that slides out and it's going to be really stiff today. But you get a couple folding chairs and you got two fixed to go down the road. You can actually put a uh, laptop over here if you want to. There's a drawer for a laptop. And this one does come with the uh, Euro style chair. I happen to have one of these. It's great. It's light enough that I can move it around anywhere. So we'll get to the refrigerator, nice big Dometic with ice maker. Gotta love that. You notice we do have a pantry uh, next to the uh, refrigerator here. It's nice and deep. Look at that. That's arm length. So what's that? Uh, 36 inches? <laughs> anyway, and you got some nice deep drawers. Look at the length of these drawers here. So we got three nice big drawers here. And then on the opposite side, we still got a couple more cabinets in here to add some other items. And there happens to be the uh, switches for the uh, bedroom slides back here on this wall instead of being in the bedroom. So you can be standing in the hallway to close your slides or open them. You'll notice a nice big area here in the hallway. Now when the slide is in, I can still get down the hallway. It's going to be a little tighter, but I can also get into the bathroom. And uh, when we're into the bathroom here, 
Uh, there's toilets got lots of room in here. We got the solid surface countertop, big mirror, lots of light, high speed fan, and we got a one piece shower in here that's actually got a bench. It's real wood, by the way. It's not plastic. This is laser. You also notice there's a skylight inside the uh, shower that can be closed. And you'll notice down here, this is your for your central vac. Happens to be the cover down here. You got a nice hose kit that comes with it that was in the lower basement. And uh, over here, this one particular unit does have a king bed in it. And Tiffin uses great mattress. It'll be a memory foam mattress and some really nice cabinets. You notice though, um, this is throughout the coach. We have, um, this is real wood, by the way. It's not plastic. The crown molding is real wood also. This is another Panasonic. I know you say we got too many TVs, but you never know. You might be in the bedroom really want one. It is a Panasonic. Everything's Panasonic through here. Uh, with, when it comes to electronics, there's no messing around with uh, Tiffin RV. Uh, they use nothing but the best. I mean, I have an RV that has three different TVs in it. Yes, I don't own a Tiffin, but uh, you know it is what it is. Um, but anyway, you have Panasonic throughout the coach. You got a place to put your receiver up in here for the uh, satellite dish, and uh, you got your DVD player back here. And like I told you prior, we do have repeaters in here, so uh, once you load your disc inside the DVD player, you can be anywhere in the coach, lots of TVs in front of you, and be able to fast forward. Nice little laundry hamper here. Got lots of big drawers. Uh, we do happen to have a stackable washer dryer in here, and as I told you before, it's vented. As you'll notice, this was a slider door. Uh, that was new in 2013. Nice big closet in here. Like I said, now we do have some uh, circuit breakers and fuse panel in here. Well, this is Frank at B Young RV in Milwaukee, Oregon. We are the number one Tiffin dealer in the Northwest and there's reasons for it. I welcome you to come here and look at the Tiffin motorhomes, whether it's uh, open road gas or the Red, the Phaeton, the Bus, or even the Breeze. I personally feel it is the finest Class A motorhome made in all the world. So please come by. If you'd like to do a test drive, uh, let me know. Thank you.